I want to continue talking about backups. I've talked about backing things up that you have in your Google Cloud. At school, we have a, a network drive, your H drive, and that's automatically backed up. But what about your personal files? Uh, everything you keep on your own personal computer. To back that up, you really need to have another hard drive. I recommend a USB hard drive. You can buy a terabyte drive for about $60. You could get a five terabyte drive for about $130. Now, you don't have to buy the biggest drive. You need first to figure out how much uh, information you have that needs backed up. If you go to your computer and go to the computer icon, then to the C drive, there's a folder called users. And inside of this folder, there is a additional folder for every user that's logged onto your computer. You can see my user folder right here. This folder has in it my desktop, my documents, my pictures, my videos, my Google Drive, my contacts, my bookmarks. This has everything that uh, this particular computer has stored that's connected to my account. If I can make a backup of this folder, I'll have a backup of everything. Now to figure out how big it is, I right click on this folder and when the menu drops down, I select Properties. This will show me a box that indicates how much disk space my particular uh, folder on this computer is taking up. You can see it's about 64 gigabytes of uh, disk space. So I need a 64 gigabyte uh, external hard drive. My one terabyte drive would be plenty. I could do this every month for a year and never have to erase anything. So I connect my USB drive. This is going to create an icon uh, for this new drive in Windows Explorer. I'm going to create a, a folder that has the dates. Uh, I'm just going to put the month and the year. That way I know when I created this backup just from the date. Now I'm going to position this window so I can have my backup drive here and my original here. All I have to do is drag this over to my backup drive and you can see it's copying that folder to my backup drive. It says it's going to take about an hour. I'm going to come back in an hour and I'm going to disconnect this from my computer. I'm going to store it in a safe place. That way if something happens to my computer, my backup is safe.